Hello everybody, I'm Gianmarco Moroni from Butterfly. Today is a very exciting day because uh, it is something I probably never seen in my experience, very long experience. And Sigilent uh, is introducing three new series of 12-bit oscilloscope. Uh, today is launch day and uh, Sigilent was so kind to send me two demo devices because actually we have a trade show next week, but I will take the opportunity to make uh, this video, which is uh, going to be a little bit long because we start with the unboxing, then we power on the unit, see a little bit the menu, and uh, we close with uh, some uh, thought about the line. The new series are SDS 800, 1000 and 3000 XHD, and they all perform uh, AC converter of 12 bit. So let's start with the unboxing. As I said, we start with the unboxing and we start with the small device of the three uh, units. And uh, this is the SDS 800 XHD. So we start with the power cable. USB cable, four probes, one, two, three, and four. The model is the PP215 for the uh, 200 megas. I'm not sure if there will be the same probe for all the line. Bear in mind that this unit is available in two and four channels. So my thinking is that the two channel will have only two probes. And here, we have the unit with all the protection. All right. Oh, yes. We also have a little bit of paper. We have uh, the quick start uh, manual and uh, the content list. Yeah, paper. We don't care about paper. Uh, the format of the unit is like the previous uh, SDS-1000XE. Uh, the addition is the color. Siglent is going to color all black units, the 12-bit. And uh, the screen is a 7-inch touch. But we will see the unit uh, power on later. Then we move to the other unit which is in shape identical to the 3000 so we have a box containing the power cable and one two three four probes those probes are SP3150A, SP3050A. Inside there is the SP3050A. So I guess it is a 500 megahertz uh, passive probe. Then we have the unit. Protection. Then we have the unit itself. The unit itself, uh, as I said before, uh, the format, the size and the weight is uh, the same of the SDS 3000, which we do not have today. I guess the main difference of the 3000 is the connector here and also the connector of the probe. Touch screen, 12.1 inch uh, and nothing we will see the performance of the video in the second part, uh, the performance of the oscilloscope in the second part of the, of the video. Uh, just uh, to show a little bit of the two unit next to the other. So this is uh, how they look like. We have fits to tilt the unit. In this case, in the other case, We have 
fits right so this is how the two unit looks like one next to the other side and back okay for the unboxing is everything so let's move to power on the unit okay after the unboxing i have set up uh, the unit connected with the cable and we are going to power them off so you can actually also understand what is the speed from the time you need from powering on the device and being able to use it so let's start In the meanwhile, we are going to talk a little bit about the specification of the 3 series. I remember that today we have the SDS 800X HD and the SDS 1000X HD. There is the third of the series, which looks like the 1000, is named the 3000, and we are also going to talk about this exciting uh, series. So first of all, uh, I also edited the video I said, uh, uh, I, I, I made a mistake, uh, just out of my mind. The display is 10.1 inch, not 12.1 inch, like I said before. I'm going to correct uh, with a small indication on uh, the previous timing. And uh, yes, the same for the 3000. Also, the 3000 is performing a 10.1 inch display. So. At the moment, uh, we are going to talk about the 800. The 800 is a unit which is coming in the format of two and four analog channels plus the optional 16 digital channel MSO and the optional arbitrary waveform generator, one channel, 25 mega. What is important to say is that the unit with two analog channel will be actually with two BNC. So it is not the way you have four BNC and you can digitally activate the two channels. So it will be two or four physical channel. There are several models. I'm going to read the model without the extension XHD, which is uh, not necessary. So we have the 802, which is a 70 megahertz two channel. 804, 70 megahertz, 4 channel, 812, 100 megahertz, 2 channel, 814, 100 megahertz, 4 channel, 822, 200 megahertz, 2 channel, 824, 200 megahertz, 4 channel. The pricing goes for 359 up to 699 euros, VAT excluded. Uh, at the time, now is end of February, if you look at this video, if you watch this video over the year, maybe the time will be changed, so I'll leave the link in the description, you can always be find uh, the actual price. So, what I want to say is there is a difference between the 70 MHz, 100 MHz and the 200 MHz, the difference is the memory. For the 70 megas and the 100 megas, you have a maximum 50 million points of memory. In the 200 megas, you have 100 million points of, uh, of memory. Uh, as I said, uh, the unit for the rest performs the same. You have maximum 2 giga sample per second of sampling. You have only one bench of sampling. So every time you use one channel, you have to, of course, reduce the speed of the acquisition but the unit will always tell you this uh, as a standard uh, you have several uh, uh, trigger and decoding you have i square c spi uart cam and lib this is the standard there are no extra uh, decoding for this uh, for this unit so mainly the option for this unit of course the probes if you need extra probes or current probes or dif differential probes Otherwise, you have the unit and um, the mixer signal channels and the arbitrary uh, channel. At the moment, the uh, MSO is about 380 euros 
and the arbitrary waveform generation is a generator is about 234 euros. For the 1000, the model are uh, 4, 11 or 2, 100 megahertz, 2 channel, 11 or 4, 100 megahertz, 4 channel, 12 or 2, 200 megahertz, 2 channel, 12 or 4, 200 megahertz, 4 channel. In this case, for this series, the specs are all the same. So we have two or four channel, 100, mega, uh, 100 million point of memory, and two giga sample of uh, sampling. Sampling, say, uh, about this, uh, the decoding, uh, we have I2C, SPI, UART, CAN, and LIN, and, and the code only, you will have CAN, FD, and uh, flex ray. Pricing starting from 959 euro up to the most expensive of the series, which is 1299 euros, of course, plus VAT. So, without VAT, those pricing. Uh, of course, when you go to the Butterfly website, you will see the pricing with the VAT indication of uh, your country of residence. So, if you are in Italy, it's 22, Germany is 19, and so on. So, don't worry about this. Uh, the website automatically calculates the exact price for you uh, to buy. Last but not least, we have the 3000 series. The 3000 series is available only in four channel and it's available at 350, 500 and 1 gigahertz. 350 is 30, 34, 350 megahertz, four channel. 30, 54, 500 megahertz, four channel and 3104, 1 gigahertz, 4 channel. What is important to remember is that in the moment, in the 3000, in the moment you will activate all 4 channel, the maximum bandwidth is 800 megahertz instead of uh, 1 gigahertz. So this is very important. I have also another note here. Yes, exactly. So, some specification, as I said, for channel 350 to 1 gigahertz, you have 400 million points of memory and 4 giga sample per second of sampling. Uh, of course, also in this way, in this case, you can add 16 digital channel for the MSO and the arbitrary waveform generator instead of 25 megahertz like the 800 and the 1000 is 50 megahertz. Talking about the standard serial decoding, you have I2C, SPI, UART, CAN and LIN. But as option, you can add uh, many more decoding. I would say that the 3000 is uh, going probably also to replace the 5000 series, uh, but uh, it's up to you and up to uh, your um, uh, application. Uh, talking about uh, size and weights, uh, now I have to read because I cannot remember. Uh, talking about the SDS 800, uh, so first of all, power consumption, we have 80 watt maximum, 40 watt typical and 4 watt typical in standby mode. Size is uh, 312 by 151 by 132 millimeter and the weight without box, without anything, is 2.6 kilograms. The 1000 series, power consumption, 120 watt maximum, 70 watt typical and 4 watt typical in, in standby mode. Uh, dimension is uh, 317 by 236 by 149, and the net weight is about 4.1 kilograms. For the 3000 series, same, 316 by 236 by 149 with a net weight of 4.1 kilograms. For the introduction is everything. Now let's talk a little bit uh, about some conclusion. Uh, in my opinion, again, as I said in the beginning, this is really a great uh, launch by Siglen because adding uh, not one, but three new series I can understand that it requires a lot of uh, development for the new devices and uh, for sure the market uh, is going uh, all to the 12-bit so replacing or making a new oscilloscope uh, all 12-bits uh, 
actually is uh, really making Siglent leading the market from the small one, which is good from hobby to students to, you know, small bench in production or labs. The 1000, it's a little bit bigger, bigger display, uh, and the 3000, and never forget that we also offer the SDS 7000A, which goes up to 3 gigahertz with 12 bit, and most probably this will be uh, even higher in, speed, in uh, frequency in the in the short future. So, uh, from the plastic uh, uh, point of view and the shape, uh, I want to confirm that Siglent is uh, way above uh, the the average of for the quality and also being uh, selling Siglent since many years almost no return. So this is really really good. The service is good. The butterfly is always year twelve. Again, I want to say that uh, it's very important if you go to the description of the video, you will find the link to each series and also the link for uh, the blog post. The blog post explain a little bit more about the unit. You can find high definition images, some more videos and so on. So what I have to say, uh, of course, the butterfly team is year 12. So reach out if you need uh, more information, visit uh, butterfly.com for all the specification and pricing about the unit, the user manual, programming manual, quick manual, they are all available for you to download. Pricing is there, quantity is always uh, available, you can check uh, online and uh, sometime we have discount code. Thank you for watching. I hope you have enjoyed this video uh, as I enjoyed making it. Uh, if so, please consider to subscribe to our channel and share the video with your uh, friends. For now is everything. Don't forget to visit butterfly.com. Thank you and see you next time. Ciao.